What's up guys, Sal here. So we've been hearing quite a lot about the specs of the Galaxy Note 20 and Note 20 Plus recently. But today we're getting an early look at the potential design of the smaller Galaxy Note 20 variant. IC Universe shared a couple of images of the handset, renders to be exact, which shows a boxy design reminiscent of the previous Galaxy Note. In fact, the front looks fairly similar to the Galaxy Note 10 with a square shape and a hole punch that's centered at the top of the display. On the back, the phone is seen sporting a rectangular camera module featuring three big sensors and one small sensor, presumably flash more like a Galaxy S20 rectangular camera housing. One thing to keep in mind though that it's not a precise rendering. In a follow-up tweet, Ice Universe says, don't believe it's special, just a rough design preview. This render actually comes from a case maker and the thing about renders from case makers is that they don't have the exact information about the bezel size or hole punch size or even the camera arrangement. So this render doesn't speak much apart from the fact that it will have a triple camera system with a rather big camera housing like the Galaxy S20. So this isn't an accurate representation of the Galaxy Note 20 but rather giving us some idea of what the design is Samsung is going for. So yesterday we got a confirmation that the Galaxy Note 20 Plus will indeed have the 108 megapixel camera like the Galaxy S20 Ultra even without the Ultra moniker. Samsung has pushed several patches and software fixes to the S20 Ultra to solve autofocus issues. But some aren't able to be fixed. So people were wondering whether those issues will be carried over to the Galaxy Note 20 Plus as well or Samsung is planning to do anything about it. Turns out they are. According to Ice Universe, Samsung will add a new sensor to assist in focusing and completely eliminate the focusing issue that we had on the S20 Ultra. As you can see, he only mentioned the Galaxy Note 20 Plus and not the Note 20. The smaller Galaxy Note 20 could have a 12 megapixel camera sensor like the S20 and S20 Plus. That's hardly a problem as the 12 megapixel sensor also does a pretty good job on the non Ultra S20 phones. So just today, Samsung has officially unveiled the rumored 50 megapixel camera sensor with large 1.2 micron size pixels. This alone should mean better low light performance as bigger pixels are able to gather more light. Samsung says this sensor has a software algorithm capable of churning out 100 megapixel snaps using light data from each photodiode. But most importantly, this sensor has a dual pixel autofocus technology for faster autofocus. The S20 Ultra lacks a dual pixel autofocus system and houses only regular face detection autofocus tag which could be what hampers its focusing capabilities. So I guess this is the new sensor Ice Universe is talking about in his tweet which is expected to resolve the autofocus issues on the Galaxy Note 20 Plus. By the way, the S20 Ultra has a 48 megapixel ultra wide secondary camera so swapping it for its first 50 megapixel dual pixel kit with tetra cell binning wouldn't be that much of a leap to imagine. In any case, I'll keep you posted when I hear more information about this handset so you can consider subscribing for that. And as always, I'll see you tomorrow. Peace out.